Hello everyone, Chevy Moon here. So today I just have a coolest news to share. And it's about the third week of the Halloween event in Adopt Me. It's pretty cool actually. Anyway, today I'll be revealing every pet and thing that's coming for this week. And the newest way to age up pets 10x faster. You guys definitely must watch and know about this. Because it's quite too soon yet very exciting. Anyway, so as I said I'm gonna reveal almost everything I found. So spoiler alert, y'all. You guys can always skip this video to avoid getting spoiled. So a big spoiler alert you guys. But if wanna ruin the surprise, like me, just keep watching hee <laughs> hee. Anyway, I'm always sick recently, I have a very low and weak immune system and very dehydrated. It's very bad actually, but here we are, and let's go. So firstly, let's talk about the newest way to age up pets easier and faster. So Adopt Me just announced that they'll be adding something similar to the aging potion, which is the sugar skull potion. Well, this is a photo I found. Yeah, I know Adopt Me still didn't show what the potion will look like, but I'm quite sure it looks like this. So a normal aging potion actually looks like this. It's an arrow-like potion, however this thing only grants 30 tasks of experience to a pet's age. So yeah, it's like you just did 30 tasks to your pet. Anyway, the Sugar Skull Potion works just how the aging potion works. However, what's different is that the Sugar Skull Potion grants 45 tasks of experience on a pet's age. That's like 15 more than how the aging potion functions. Yeah, so for clearer understanding, the Sugar Skull Potion grants 45 tasks. Meanwhile, the aging potion grants 30 tasks. So clearly the Sugar Skull Potion actually grants more tasks. But however, to get them, the Sugar Skull Potion, we're gonna have to purchase it for 60 Robux each. Yeah, unlike the Aging Potion, which we could only grind and get for free, the Sugar Skull Potion is a premium potion. Some are surprised about the price, like thankfully it's not overpriced. I mean, 60 Robux for 45 tasks done in your pet, is it worth it? I kinda think so though. Oh, and I almost forgot. The Sugar Skull Potion is also untradeable just like the Aging Potion. Which sucks actually, but it probably has purpose. So if you want one, you're gonna have to buy it your own for it's untradeable. What do you guys think? Do you like this idea and concept? Anyway, let's move on and talk about the pets. Okay, so there are a couple of pets coming this week, which is very nice. And soon, the last research tube, which is this one, will have a new pet that awaits. So I'm gonna tell you what that pet is. It is the rare Marabou Stork. Well, it kinda looks like this, and voila. It's so awesome actually. Well, the Marabou Stork in real life is actually quite creepy. But it looks fine here. I do like how it has glowing eyes, it's very cool and almost intimidatingly cute. Anyway, the Stork is a rare pet. That's available for 19,000 candies. Well, at least very affordable though. Anyway, next let's talk about these three here. Okay, so as expected we're getting the box effect event pet. So there's a new box coming. It's the Halloween chick box. Yeah, it looks more like this actually, like a coop or something, with red bloody eyes, staring. So each of these boxes actually costs for 17,000 candies. And it's quite worth it though. Anyway, the box will have three pets inside, different types and varieties. The rare zombie chick, the ultra rare ghost chick, then lasty, the legendary evil chick. They all look quite similar in appearance. They're all super cute too, to be honest. But personally I love the ghost one, especially those floating like spirits. They're not what I have expected, but it's actually fine though. I mean, I just love how cute it is. The other chicks are also cute, I love the glowing eyes of the evil chick. And I love bone detail of the zombie chick. Just check that out, its bone is coming out. Super cute. I did thought they'll be similar to the pet chick. Although they were also chick. I thought they'll look more like this chick. Hee <laughs> hee. But I guess the chicks from the box is also cute. It's so tiny lol. I also did thought the evil chick would look more like this. Like it's a little chick but it's black and has red eyes. I swear this could have been cute too. But I guess we can't argue, the real evil chick still does look cute too. But I guess people could have hated them for not using creativity though. So I guess it's a good thing. Well, there are also toys coming. Yeah, it's pretty cool too. But that's all I could share right now everyone. So thank you so much for watching. 
I really appreciate your time. Anyway, comment down week 3, if you stayed for a chance to be in the shoutouts in my next video. Anyway, what do you think about the next update? Do you find it great and exciting as well? Don't forget to like and subscribe for more fun and exciting videos. Stay cool and stay safe as always. This is Chevy signing out.